Let's solve some of the questions from NSO class 7th and these are pertaining to level 2 examination. So preparing well with your level 2 examination. The first question which is asked here talks about understanding or calculating the moisture in the soil. So here the initial sample has a size of 150 grams. Now it was sun dried for 2 days and the new sample amount was 120 grams. So 150 grams was the original ones after sun dried it becomes 120 grams so that means the water content is how much 30 grams now you have to calculate the percentage of moisture that means 30 divided by the original soil sample in 200 that gives you how much 20 percent so 20 percent becomes the right option for this question the next is understanding the conduction in the plant now conduction in the plant takes place through various ways for the conduction, there are two important organs as we understand. Within the plant, this is a cross section that is given and there is a star shaped structure. So within that star shaped structure is what is present is known as xylem. The outside region is the phloem. Now, what is the difference between xylem and phloem? Xylem takes the water and the nutrients from the roots towards the leaves for the process of synthesis of food. Phloem is the tissue that takes the processed food or the prepared food to all the plant parts. So phloem takes the carbohydrates or the starch. Xylem conducts water and nutrients or minerals. So why is the xylem which conducts water and minerals? So that's correct and Z is phloem which transports carbohydrate. So B becomes the right option here and here we can see another uh, clear cross section where we have the phloem cells on the outside and the xylem cells in the inside. The next is the picture for insectivore plants. Now P and Q both of them are insectivore plants. P is an example of sundew. Q is an example of bladder wort. Now what is the difference? Sundew you have uh, spikes. On those spikes there is mucilage. So when an insect comes it sticks to it. Bladder wort has a bladder which creates a partial vacuum and sucks the insect inside. Now bladder wort uh, is one of the species. So this is an example of sundew. This is an example of pitcher plant. All of these are insectivores. This is an example of Venus flytrap. Okay, where you have rapid active movement of closure and uh, opening, and this actually encompasses the uh, the passing by insects. And then uh, bladder traps are found in bladder birds. So here, if we go into this question, both P and Q are insectivores. P has glandular tentacles with mucilage at the end. As you can see in this color diagram, this is a jelly layer of mucilage which sticks the insects and then Q is the bladder word which has bladder to catch the insects. So D becomes the right option for this question. So all these questions which we have discussed here pertain to conduction in plants, uh, the types of plants, insectivore plants and then understanding and calculating the amount of moisture which is technically uh, we can say a uh, mental ability question but yes since it's related to biology we have discussed it here. I hope this was clear and do follow the link below for more practice questions for your level 2. Prepare well, have a wonderful day ahead.